Hey y'all, it's your girl Amir. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So before I get into the video, I just want to let y'all know how excited and filled with joy I am to be actually making another YouTube video. Last time I made a vlog was literally two years ago when I was 18 in my studio. Like, I'm really excited to be back on here. But moving into the video this week, I'm going to be bringing y'all along with me so y'all can see how a week in my life is. It's, it's actually the 4th of July, y'all. It's literally the 4th of July. It's Thursday and it's 3.36 right now. I have to be to work at 6. And I already got me some rest and everything. I do nice shit. So I feel like I'm good. All right, so if you're new to my channel, my whole niche and like what the whole purpose of my channel is to really inspire girls that's like in the position I'm in or the girls that want to be in the position I'm in. So often you will see me focusing on school a lot. That's one of my biggest goals right now. And I know a lot of girls, literally, we should not have any more nurse shortages after like five more years. Literally, there's so many girls in nursing school. And I really hope that the girls that's like, really going into the medical field and stuff really have passions for it because i see on a day-to-day -day basis like literally nurses treating patients like crap and it's like at different hospitals this hospital is pretty good but yeah i just want to say that i really hope that y'all really have a passion for being in uh healthcare and have a reason for actually you know helping people but i also wanted to let y'all know that i want to broaden my um niche a little bit like i want to do more content creator things like i want to do clothing hauls let y'all more in on my personal life as well like dates that i go on story times just you know random stuff like that yeah i'm really excited to start this show y'all like this new area of my life that i'm in if y'all seen this phone case please ignore it i gotta get a new one so bad i'm gonna get that soon but yeah i'm really excited for that all right so it's about to hit four o'clock so i'm gonna go ahead and edit the clips that i just did let's get into the video This is the exact reason I don't leave out the house. It's so hot. Y'all, it's 119 degrees right now. Bitches is snap back. You have an entire like one flat going hard. So right now I'm in the supply room at work. I'm just filling up my little cart. Um, I don't have that many patients. I literally only got nine patients, y'all. It's going to be a real smooth night. I'm really just going to be doing homework. We're getting ahead on homework because I really don't have that much to do. So yeah, I'll see y'all later. Hey y'all, so right now I'm in the supply room to come talk to y'all. It's 4 11 right now, if you can see. I don't really have too many of anything, so I'm about to do my last round and be out of here. Hey y'all, so I'm on my extremely good time. It's literally only 5 12, and I only got two more patients, and it's literally just vitals for them. So I'm literally back up chilling because I'm trying as I'm going. So. All right y'all, so I just got me some breakfast. I got me some cheesy eggs and some sausage so today was a really good show what i really miss about living back home where i was at detroit is the food coney island had the best breakfast like you go get that hash brown with them cheesy eggs and the sausage baby is no nothing can compete with that i had a really good shift tonight y'all it went by fast but yeah that's what i miss about detroit say hey to my youtube YouTube. Say hi to YouTube. Hey YouTube. He literally, you know how you came over and gave me the report for um right. he put me all the way at 32 and it wasn't even the ones you had. He gave me Corey 32 and gave Corey. I was like, what did you do that for? The car got too many problems. <laughs> Invest that much money or just get another one. I yeah, it, you might as well, especially if yeah, it's someone with like the transmission or something. You take that car to them, they'll give you a lower down payment. Yes. Yeah. So, that was a lot of days you work. You don't have enough to get two cars. No, one car. <laughs> I gotta pay the bills too, so. You a section eight bitch, I'm in here buying eight sections. Eight figure nigga, he just ate me for breakfast. That man is so beautiful. Y'all know JP, that man is gorgeous. Like, I'm about to ride past my coworker. I don't even know what he's saying. I'll get you. 
Hey y'all, good morning, beautiful people. I just got out of bed like an hour ago. Why is it not made up yet? Mind your business. I really want to get back in it and take another nap, but we're not gonna do that. And I'm over here talking about good morning, like it's not 2 p.m. But that's how, that's my morning. So I literally just woke up. That's my morning. I don't know where this motivation came from, but I've been telling myself that I really need to be consistent with my workout. Um, I ended up getting a treadmill in my room, so I won't have to go to the gym as much. That's definitely an investment because most of my workouts are cardio. So yeah, I feel like that was a really good investment for me. I always like to write down what I need to do for the day. So I need, I really was supposed to do that yesterday, but it's fine, I can still do it today. But yeah, that's what we about to do. I'm about to tr uh, get this workout in and my life is not perfect. I do not be doing that every day. I just really, I'm trying to get in the habit of doing that every day, so. Oh my God, that just smells so good. When I tell y'all, this candle smells so freaking good. My friend got it for like a housewarming gift. Y'all, it smells so good. It's like it's like a cologne, but it's like a perfume at the same time. Yeah, it smells so good. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make my bed up just so I can come home to, you know, a nice made up bed. Hey y'all, so I'm on my way to work. Y'all, I'm so hot. These guys will not let me win. Hey y'all, I literally haven't talked to y'all since yesterday. It is 4.30 right now and 4.30 a.m. And I'm just about to start this pure wig and get to the rest of my patients. I do have a few things to do, so I'm probably gonna get out here a little later, but that's okay. More money for me. Yeah, I just wanted to update y'all on what's going on and I'll see y'all later. Hey. I'm recording myself. I did you too. What's the hey? You see you, go Lopes. Hey, hey y'all. So I just made it home and I'm so happy. Your girl is tired. It's literally eight and about to be nine o'clock and I just got home. Mind y'all, I get off at six in the morning. And my coworker went to breakfast and I took her home. So that's kind of what oh took my, up my God, time. It's not funny. Um, before I go to bed, I'm gonna just do some homework. I didn't finish it at work because it got pretty busy. I'm over here talking about it got pretty busy. I took a nap. I took a nap. I went to sleep instead of doing my homework. So, but that's okay because it wasn't due and I'm gonna do it today. Y'all, good morning. Um, And really good morning this time. It's like, I don't even know what time it is. Not me on a date and that. <laughs> it's um 10 o'clock on Sunday. I know I never can say good morning to y'all because I'm always waking up in the middle of the day. I didn't have work last night. So I was literally just in and out of sleep doing my homework. I like to space my homework out, y'all. That's the only way it's gonna get done. Like I gotta take breaks and go back to it. Yeah, I'm so excited that I did not procrastinate and I got literally everything done. I do have to do one more discussion. No, actually two more discussions because you know how you got to respond to a bunch of people and all of that other stuff. So I got to do that before 11 tonight. So I'm just do that here. So at work, I won't have nothing to do. I'm going to be so freaking tired if we don't have that much to do at work. Cause usually my homework be taking up a lot of my time. Hey y'all, so I just got the shower. I'm about to brush my teeth. And I'm so sorry about this. Um, it's not even a fan, there's no air coming out. It's just loud for no reason. Um, look, literally, loud as fuck for no reason. It's not even doing nothing. Fuck, fuck, fuck. We got a whole shit, no, I know this. Stand on my ass so I can. I really need to give me another tongue scraper so bad. I'm so tired of choking myself trying to, that looks so long. <laughs> But yeah, I need to give me a tongue scraper. I need to make a list. I just I need to give me a phone case. I need to give me a tongue scraper. I need a few things though. I just moved into my apartment by the way. So I need a few things. But y'all, I want to do like some type of chit chat video because I'm a very opinionated person and I feel like I would eat those up. I was thinking about like some type of dating as a plus size girl or something like that because I got some good opinions on it. I feel like that's a topic that not too many people talk about, but it's such a big topic. Like. Let's really talk about it. If you are faithful to my videos and you made it to this part, leave in the comments like some type of video I should do for a chit chat advice type video. Let me know, cause I'm ready. All right y'all, so I'm about to head out for work and put some lotion on my elbows cause being light skin don't always save me. I'm about to play every day I'm hustling cause that's what I feel like I'm doing every day of the week. <laughs> Damn fried. Out just like my artist. Trading places. 
I didn't know that until I just looked yeah. right here. All right, y'all gotta say hey to the baddest. Say hey. hey. That's Leo, y'all. Hey, y'all. So it's gonna be a really busy night for me. Um, it's literally 24 patients for me, and it's only two texts on the floor, so I'm probably not gonna get to talk to y'all, so I'll see y'all when I get home. Hey y'all, so this is the last clip of this video. I really enjoy taking little clips throughout my week and showing y'all like a little glimpse into my life. I enjoy editing everything. So I really hope y'all enjoy the video too. And I also hope that I inspire girls to do the same. I feel like anybody can say that, but when I say that, I really mean it. Like y'all don't understand how many girls come into my DMs explaining like their situation at home and how stuff is getting toxic. And it don't even have to be like living with family. Like even if you in a relationship or something and you know you just need to leave like most girls will stay because they feel like they can't be independent girl who who said that um because what i also hope that i motivated some of the girls that is in a situation i'm in because i know sometimes it can get hard sometimes i want to go back to mommy and daddy i'll be ready for, for somebody to come take care of me but you know we getting grown like if you're young around my age we getting grown we gotta learn how to do this you know you don't want to be 30 years old. And I'm not judging nobody. You don't want to be 30 years old living at your parents' house, still having to, you know, go through their rules and everything. So, yeah, I really hope that I inspire, you know, girls to do this. It's not that hard. Y'all see I'm in school and doing it at the same time. Y'all got this. Y'all got this. Trust me. Y'all really got this. So, yeah, until next time, comment any video suggestions, any advice videos y'all want me to do. I'm so excited to be back on YouTube. And, yeah, I'll see y'all in the next vlog.